how to live stream to Instagram from your PC. I'm gonna show you how to do that using OBS Studio and an extra little tool that will help you get the information you need from Instagram to send your stream to the right place. Now I'm gonna show you the additional tool that you're gonna to need to get on Instagram from your PC, but there's a critical piece of setup that you need to know or your first stream is probably not gonna go the way you expected. So make sure you watch the entire video. All right, so let's assume that you've already set up OBS Studio with the scenes that you want to stream and you're ready to go live. If you don't know how to do that and you wanna learn, then check out the card I'm gonna put up on the screen. Click that or go down in the description and click it's a playlist on how to start from scratch and learn how to stream. All right, so in this scene, I've just got an old video playing on a loop so that I can demonstrate whether or not this works. Um, this is actually a video that you should watch after this one. So I'll put a link to it at the end of this video. All right, so open a web browser and go to getstreamon.com. Go to the downloads, download it for the uh, operating system that you use. I use Windows, so I just click download there. And then you run that and you'll get a window like this. So just log in with your Instagram info. And it says, what are you streaming? Just put whatever you want. Let's say you're playing chess, I'll put chess. Hit start live stream. This is not gonna actually take you live yet. It's gonna give you the stream key and the server URL that you need to put in OBS so that when you hit go live in OBS, you go to the right place. So I'm gonna click this to copy the stream URL. We'll go into OBS Studio, go into settings, go to the stream tab, and then change the service to custom. And for server, you're gonna paste that there. Go back to stream on, copy the stream key, paste that there, hit apply and okay. And then when you're ready to go live, you're gonna click go live in both stream on and in OBS Studio and you should be live. I'm also gonna go to Instagram.com and use it to verify whether I'm actually live or not. You can probably use your phone as well for this. All right, so I'm gonna hit go live on stream on, says I'm live, and I'm gonna hit start streaming on uh, OBS Studio. So I wasn't able to see myself live when I'm logged into my own Instagram account, but if I go and log into a different Instagram account and then go to my profile, I can see that I'm live. And if I tap that, it goes to my live stream. And what's cool is there's uh, messages showing who's watching and you can chat to them and they can chat back to you and it's pretty cool. The other thing that's cool is once you're live, this stream on window will have this little comments button at the bottom and that'll show you the actual live chat uh, that your stream is getting on Instagram. So you don't have to like use your phone to chat because you're already on your PC. Um, you probably wanna have this nearby so you can put it off to the side or whatever in OBS. Now the other thing that's worth remembering is that Instagram is vertical with live streams. So you need to set up OBS for vertical scenes so that people don't just see the center of a horizontal stream. So how do you do that? Go in OBS, go to settings, go to the video tab, and then you can actually edit this field. So it's 1920 by 1080 right now, which is horizontal. If you want it to be vertical, just flip those numbers. So make it 1080 X 1920. Make sure that the output is the same. And then when you click apply and okay, your scene formats are now vertical. So then build your scenes to be vertical and um, stream that way and people will see the entire thing. And if you wanna learn how to send your stream to multiple streaming platforms, like do Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook all at the same time, for example, check out this video right here. If this video helped you, consider subscribing because I post all the time and I wanna make sure you don't miss them. All right, that's it, see you around.